<laughs> oh my god, my teeth. Sponge on white face paint. I also concealed my brows, but I recommend to use your real brows for this particular look. I used a black eyeliner to fill in my brows and then spool them out. I will also be moving my head a lot in this video. Prime your lids and messily apply black eyeshadow. Blend it out for a grungy look. For a more intense look, I am applying more black to the bottom lids. Blend out to the brows and create a tiresome look. Also create bags under the eyes using a gray shadow. Don't worry if it looks a bit much because we will gradient it later. Use a reference photo to create cracks on the skin. I use black face paint to sketch it out. Then I used an eyeliner to intensify it. Sponge some more white face paint on the bags for a gradient effect. I'm contouring my nose to a pointy shape and also contouring my cheeks. Be aware of my face expressions. To create the veins on Muriel's neck, I'm contouring heavily on my own. Tightline and waterline. Again, I am using a black eyeliner to draw on my lips and then filling it in with a black lipstick. Using that same lipstick, I am creating little holes to make texture. This is also why I wanted the white face paint to be a bit patchy. Blend it out and you're finished! Thank you guys so much for watching and do you like my teeth? I think it's an improvement. Please like, share, subscribe, comment if you want to. Also, I am so excited. Let me know if Halloween is your favorite holiday too. It's one of mine. Anyways, I love you guys. Thank you all for supporting me and stopping. It's like, ah! I'll talk to you guys later. Bye! Mwah.